one thing I want to ask you, and this is kind of backtracking, but going off like with the Andrew Tate shit, uh, immediately upon his arrest, everybody starts talking about what about Jeffrey Epstein? And you've mentioned him a couple times. Why do you think like there is no more info on that? It's just been brushed under the rug. Like, I don't know. What do you think? Well, they don't want to expose people. But I mean, why is like, why can't we talk about it? Ooh, well, why are people so afraid? It's, like, it's not allowed. Um, look, I don't. I, I mean, weirdly, I I know a lot of people who are in just because of my age and just having been in the media for thirty years. I know a lot of the people who are in his orbit and who knew him really well. So I'll tell you what I know. It's I just had a lunch about this on Friday. It was really interesting um, with one of his closest friends. Here's what we know. I think there were six million dollars, six hundred million dollars recovered in cash and assets in his estate. I think that's the right number. It may have been seven hundred, hundreds of millions, and that was what four years ago that he died. They do not know now, like an army of forensic accountants, where that money came from. And I said to and my friend has direct knowledge of this. So I said to him, like, how can you not know where hundreds of millions of dollars came from? Like, they just don't know. They've had four years to figure it out and trace the wire transfer. No, nope, no idea. Six hundred million. Yes, and that's of the recovered assets. So that's the value of his real estate and his cash and his equities or whatever. There is a belief, and my friend shares it, that there's at least as much that will never be recovered, that it's just hidden. So I'm a very conventional person. I work for a salary. I don't know that much about money. I, I was like, how can that even be? He's like, no, that's totally possible. Well, we know it's possible because it happened. So we don't know where he made his money. He he was not running a hedge fund. That's not true. He executed like no trades. He was not a finance guy. So where'd all that money come from? Unknown. The second thing we know for a fact is that he was killed in federal custody. He mm -hmm. was murdered. That's true. And if you look into it as I did, I spent a week looking into it because his brother Mark reached out to me. And again, I know nothing else. Like I don't know what Jeffrey Epstein was doing. I don't know. There's I've never seen any tapes. Like I don't know anything. So I, the two things I know, we don't know where the money came from. We don't know what he did for a living. And we know that he was murdered. He was murdered in the special housing unit of federal lockup in Manhattan. How so, do we know he was murdered? Oh, well, look into it, dude. We did a whole segment on it on my show. Nobody cared. Um, I'm going to watch it after. You should. It's um, it's beyond belief. And I'm very skeptical of any kind of conspiracy theory or whatever. Why don't more people go after this, though? We know that he was murdered because, well, for one thing, I, a friend of mine is one of the people who last talked to him on the phone the day he was killed. And he had a expectation of a bail hearing in two days. He thought he was getting out. He was not despondent at all. I talked to his lawyer, told me the same thing. They moved someone out of his cell. They put two people, one of whom was not even a full-time prison guard, on duty. None of the cameras trained on the cell worked. They were all out of it that night. <laughs> they locked the front of the special housing unit that had eight cells in it, but then they opened all the cells inside. So who was it? So I asked a really simple question, the Bureau of Prisons. Who were the other? So there are eight cells, 16 minus his cell because he was alone. So that means there are 14 other inmates there that night. What are their names? Where'd they go? Some of them are transferred out right after. Who were these people? Can't tell you that. Really? You can't tell me that? Well, on the basis of what? Because some inmate at a federal prison's privacy concerns like Trump telling, what are you even talking about? Meanwhile, the Attorney General of the United States under Trump, Bill Barr, issues a statement being like, no, we know it's totally. Bill Barr lied. There's no question that Bill Barr well, he clearly suspected Epstein was murdered, but stopped the investigation into it. I went and read Bill Barr's book in which he explains all this, and it's like complete bullshit and transparent bullshit. So I have no idea why the Attorney General of the United States would be lying about this, but there's literally no question that he did. I know him. So we, Bill Barr is a super nice guy. We reach out to Bill Barr like, hey, why don't you come on and explain why you lied about Jeffrey Epstein's death? Uh, no. So I, I don't want to overstate what I know. I'm just telling you what I do know. Mm -hmm. He was killed. Yeah. Wow. By whom? No idea. We could guess. But as my friend said, I said to my friend on Friday, actually, who do you think killed Epstein? And he goes, the list of people who wanted to kill Epstein was so long. <laughs> I mean, like, it could be anybody. Wow. But whoever did it, here's the one thing I'll say. Whoever did it, was able to do it in the most secure lockdown in the United States of America yeah. and then get away with it. So I was interviewing all these people, like, will you come on the show and talk about it? No, why? And one of them said to me, whoever killed Epstein clearly has a lot of power. <laughs> I mean, like, if I said to you, I want you to kill this guy in the special housing unit federal lockup in Manhattan, 
You gotta like, have some pull. You'd be like, I'd love to kill him, but like, how do you do that? Yeah, yeah. Right? It'd right. be pretty hard to pull that off. Well, someone pulled it off. So that tells you a lot about that, whoever that group of people was. Mm. They're no one to fuck with. <laughs> 